Basketball on skates. We have food and we are somewhere fun and it's gonna be bedtime any minute. So today is the big day. We are supposed to be flying to San Diego. We've got our bags packed and now Janae is throwing up. And it's so sad when a little baby throws up because they don't know what's going on and she just like cries and oh, it's so sad. Anyway, we don't know what we're going to do about our trip. Our flight is later this afternoon so we still have time that if she doesn't throw up again, we might be okay because stomach bugs can pass pretty quickly and she was throwing up in the nighttime. Anyway, or the other option is that Jeremy will go ahead with all the other kids and Janae and I will stay here until she's healthy and then fly out. It's hard because we keep hoping that she's gonna be getting better but then she throws up again and it's just so hard to see your baby in pain like that and not feeling good and the timing is terrible. We're ice skating. How's it going? Good. Did you guys build something awesome? Mm -hmm. Let's Look. see it. Stick the marbles in. See, it jumps into there. That's cool. Just weird with the shadows. Shadows are kind of cool, huh? Yeah. I'm in a sunny spot because I'm cold. Do you know what the most important thing is for some of the best scientists in the world? Cool. Observation. Just looking at the world, looking at shadows, looking at nature. Really? Yeah, really. I think it's so cool that you're observing your shadow. Yeah. I normally just look out the window. So I saw the greatest thing ever. Nene is acting happy. She took a little nap. And she ate a little bit. She ate a tiny bit. So we're waiting to see if she'll keep that down and then I can feed her some more. She just wants to go out and play with the kids, but I'm nervous about that. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. It's stinky. I think, I think this might work. Hi. With a long travel day, we're trying to have the kids like get their wiggles out and use up some energy being active as much as possible. So we pulled the cars out of the garage one last time. We're making basketball. Basketball on skates? Okay, let's see it. <laughs> Good job, Caleb. Whoa, that was close. You guys, think of how much better you are at skating now. Yeah. From the first day. Hey, Lisi. Hey, what? Show us how to get down. No way. Show us how to get down. Okay. D. What do you think, Nene? Hey, what? Show us how to get down. Uh, no way. Show us how to get down. Okay. G O W N. That's the way to get down. D O W N. That's the way to get down. So Elise is looking at this. Is it a puzzle? Uh huh. She's looking at this puzzle, and she started singing this song. Wait, how does? Alabama, Alaska, Arizona, Arkansas, California, Colorado, Connecticut, do do do, Georgia, Georgia, Hawaii, Idaho, Illinois, Indiana. <laughs> so anyway, her starting to see this reminded me of this video we have. We posted it like it it's, was filmed before we ever started vlogging. I think it's when you're three years old. And you like skipped all of Texas and Utah. <laughs> I think it was three. It was three years old. 
Yeah. Uh, Ohio, Oklahoma, <laughs> Oregon, Pennsylvania. Rhode Island, South Carolina, South Dakota, Tennessee, Texas, Utah, Vermont, Virginia, Washington, West Virginia, Wyoming, Wisconsin, Wyoming. Shall we begin? So our awesome friend Stacy drove us to the airport and now we get to unload everything. Let's begin now. Okay, well I know that looked like a ton of luggage and it was. We have five ginormous bags and we're taking three car seats and it's just a lot to pack. But I'm actually feeling pretty proud of myself about it because there are seven of us in our family and we're gonna be gone for a full month and we need all of our homeschool stuff. Like I've got their math stuff and their spelling stuff and two of the girls are having birthdays while we're gone and so I've got their birthday stuff and so it was just a lot to fit in. So we did it. <laughs> and well, Caleb. Caleb. I beat you guys. Janae found a dog. Hey. You guys ready to get on the airplane? So I got this teething necklace. She is loving it. It's a good idea, because we didn't want to drop a teething toy. Yes, I like that it's attached to me so it's not always falling on the ground. I trade some more. Five, six, seven, eight. I just keep your fingers straight. <laughs> <laughs> exploring our new rental house. I think this place is perfect. It is really adorable. Kendra just asked if I'm trying the Wi-Fi. Anytime we go stay somewhere for a long time, whether or not it has good Wi-Fi makes a big difference for uploading videos. Well, the weather here is amazing. I'm in a short sleeve shirt and flip flop. So the last hour or so we've spent settling into our rental house and I really like it. It's got character. Like its layout is fun and unique and the outdoor space, oh, it's just beautiful. All right, let's do this. Hey. So it's past 10 p.m. Kansas City time. Our kids are starting to melt down, but we haven't really had dinner. It's a crazy night. But we have food, and we are somewhere fun, and it's gonna be bedtime any minute. Well, the kids are finally asleep, and I am completely exhausted, but I'm so grateful to be here. The rental house is beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys all of it when the light 
is out in the daytime. Um, and we're just excited. We're looking forward to our month that we get to spend here in San Diego. And I'm also just feeling really, really grateful. This morning started out pretty rough. Janae had thrown up in the nighttime and then this morning she threw up twice all over me and she was just really really miserable and I spent most of the morning just holding her trying to comfort her any way that I could and Jeremy gathered the kids together and they prayed and they prayed that Janae could get better so we could all travel together because the thought of traveling with a throwing up baby wouldn't be fun for her or me or everyone else on the airplane and so we were seriously discussing delaying our flight Jeremy and I prayed for her and I know my parents were praying for her and sometimes it amazes me that God cares about the little things and I'm just feeling really grateful. Good night, get us out. And the house looked like it has blown up. Say goodbye to Granny Jo. Move your body. I'm going to show you something. She's She's <laughs> Can we tell them where we're going? We're going to...